All right, guys. First video. I think uh, I'm gonna do the classic unboxing video. New YouTube channel, Life Outdoors today. Um, I am your host, Steve. <laughs> hey, so what we got here is um, got me a little something from uh, eBay. Come from Anglers uh, International Resources. First time I ever used the guy, he had 100%. I'm assuming this guy. Um, and uh, several hundred sales, so I thought it was all right. Trying to rebuy a little piece of my childhood. Today we're going to use the Spider Co. Pilmar Terror 2 and the Digicam in black to open this up. So uh, let's get right into it. Pretty much standard packaging. Now, I unboxed something once before and I cut a little too deep, so uh, let's see if I can avoid that this time. Break down the seal. I like to break the seal. I know some guys don't, but uh, I'm going a little shallow here, guys, because so, I don't want to cut the box. All right, <clears throat> so there we go. What do we have? What do we have? Okay, this should be uh, uh, the proverbial packing list. Hey, a little handwritten thank you. That's great. Um, I did pay about $35 for this item. Um, so we'll see. Quit wishing, go fishing, anglers, international resources. Okay, so that must be. Uh, be the guy's website and store and phone number. <clears throat> He's out of Illinois. So that's nice. Alright, so uh, you guys know what that stuff is. So what do we have? We have the classic Zepco 33 reel. Um, I'll show you what inflation does. There's a sale price of $7.76 on this box. But, uh, yeah. So let's get right into it. Now, this is supposed to be unused. So let's see, cellophane, obviously it's probably been taken out or just dried over the years. And uh, there it is. The Zepco 33. It's even got the little factory line keeper. Looks like the factory uh, knot in it. Uh, sticker. Real filled with string, the line watcher's line. <laughs> How old's that ad? Um, yeah. yeah, this is the old one. This ain't the old old. This is the, uh, that's not the metal. That's the uh, fiber reinforced polymer or, or resin uh, or uh, fiberglass, I think it is. Uh, 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 FR. Uh, uh, FR, what do they call it? Fiber reinforced resin. Anyways, that stuff. Um, Zepco Division of Brunswick Corporation. Okay, so this reel is uh, one from the 70s, I would say, uh, looking at it. The, um, the aluminum knob here has got a little bit of storage uh, corrosion. Um, but uh, everything else is uh, I mean it, I would say it's unused it looks to be there's no cracks uh, no wear don't look like the real seat's ever been mounted up yeah for sure um, she's uh, I'm going to call her brand new um Put this stuff back in the box here. Instruction manual. I don't think I need that. I threw a lot of line as a kid with one of these, so I think we can forego the instructions. Um, let's just check it for a function test real quick. 
pull out a little longer. Of course, these only got one pin pickup. They ain't all fancy, so you can hear the bait clickers even on. There it is. So, get the bait clicker. Sounds like the bait clicker might be a little sticky. It feels a little sticky. It's, uh, of course, obviously been in a box for quite a while, so uh, I would say I need to. There we go. Yeah, that works. Let's uh, let's tighten the drag. <clears throat> of course, this is a little different than what they are now. These drags were always a little touchy, guys. They're they're kind of half major at best. You just kind of make a real small adjustment. So, yeah, the drag is reacting though. I think they're getting tighter. So yeah, a little line retrieve sound. Um, of course, that should flip the. Yeah, that stops it. That's your anti reverse. We didn't uh, didn't have one way bearings back in the day. So yeah. Definitely. Looks to be the real deal. Good shape. Let you guys check that out one more time. I know uh, who doesn't like that. But uh, yeah, that's the first video. I'm going to try to make a few more. I always watch these unboxing videos. I think they're great. <laughs> I don't know why. It's just, just like getting a Christmas present, I guess. And uh, I'm real excited about that. I mean... Uh, some might some might dog the uh, price I paid, but uh, for me, buy a little piece of my childhood back. I don't care. Now I gotta find me a lake new fiberglass pole from the air, and uh, we'll be set to go fishing. Let me get this out here so you can look at that box one more time. I like a little knife porn. All right, guys. Thanks for watching.